No one, everyone wants to be served. No one wants to serve. And yet we're called to be servants. When Paul uses this word for servant in, in 1 Corinthians 14, it's a very, a very unique word. It's not the, his most common word for service, diakonos, from which got, we get our word deacon. It's a word that, listen, the root word, the root of that word servant means to row. R-O-W, row, as in a boat. The prefix of that word means huper, means under. I'll give it to you again. This word for servant means, it's, it's a picture word of a servant, a slave, listen now, who is an under rower. God says to you, pastor, man of God, woman of God, we are servants of God. And we serve as under rowers. Anybody see uh, see uh, Ben Hur? Remember that Charlton Heston? Remember that? Uh, and remember the scene where they're where they're uh, he, he's a slave now and he's underneath and he's rowing. Remember that? Remember that scene? And 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 he's rowing and, and he's rowing and rowing and rowing. He's underneath the deck of the ship. Stay with me. I'm going somewhere on this one. He's underneath the deck of the ship, and he's a servant. He's a slave rowing. Now listen. The rower does not determine the direction of the ship. Let me go back to this side over here. <laughs> the the, the under-rower does not determine the direction of the ship. There's a captain who determines the direction. The under-rower does not determine the destination of the ship. There's a captain that determines the destination. The under roar does not even determine the speed of the ship. But there's an appointed time in which this ship will land at its destination. Uh, in my culture, we talk about it like this. this it, we say like this in, in black culture. Tis the old ship of Zion. Get on board. Get on board. King Jesus is my captain. Get on board. Get on board. It's bound for glory. Get on board. Because we're servants. Someone's here today. And you're discouraged. It's not moving as fast as you want it to. You're not the captain. It's not happening as fast as someone else is happening. You're not the captain. It's not building and growing the way you planned it to. You're not the captain. You have one job. You keep on rowing, and one day you'll hear him say, Servant of God, well done. You've been faithful over a few things. Somebody help me praise God in this house. We, we, are, called, we are called to be servants. Servants.